For more than 100 years, the U.S. economy has been the world's largest national economy. Nevertheless, even the greatest economy in the world isn't safe from recession. There's a consensus among both economists and academics that the U.S. has been in a heavy recession since 2008. The, the major recession started in 2008 with the uh, stock market crashing, the uh, banks closing on uh, mortgages, uh, the fallout of uh, businesses closing, and a huge increase in uh, unemployment which has had a ripple effect throughout the United States and especially in California, which has led uh, the direction of uh, education in California to be looking at how do we build back the economy and how do we provide a uh, recovering to the workforce and, and economic development. One of the things that's really set this recession apart from other recessions is something that's being called a jobless recovery. And what we're finding is that many manufacturers are putting money into machines and not people. But we're finding that that's not true across all sectors. There's certain skills that will always take a person. We're finding that this is true in welding. We're finding that this is true in auto. We're finding the health profession, as America ages, we need paramedics, we need nurses, and we need allied health professionals. And we're also finding that increasingly, Americans are looking inward and saying, I can build a job on my own. I can create something. I can become an entrepreneur. And Cuesta has been able to reach all of those students and prepare them for a future. And we believe that in doing this, we're building a stronger economy and a better America. Well, we pride ourselves also on our strong uh, technical program. Um, Ninety percent of our students who complete certificates and degrees in career technical education have a job in that field within a year from the completion of their program. We're very proud of that statistic and it feeds right into the solution that, that the community colleges can provide for the, the workforce and economic development of California. The Business and Entrepreneurship Center at Cuesta College primarily focuses on assisting business and industry with advanced business consulting services. In effect, we help grow the economy. We partner with the Business Education Department in working with students in hosting business plan competitions, marketing plan competitions, and advertising competitions. We also provide the funding for those cash awards. So in effect, we help those students actually start their own businesses and be successful in the local economy. Quest's business program has several components. Entrepreneurship and small business management is one of them. We also go into marketing and advertising, and then also management. In each of our entrepreneurship and small business management and marketing courses, students are required to research and prepare detailed plans for their business proposition. And then they have something when they leave the course to be able to literally to go out to a bank, get funding, and start the business. A lot of the benefits that I uh, obtained through the Cuesta uh, Business Entrepreneurship Center, uh, one in particular is the competitions. Uh, competition, you're, you're actually in a real-world environment, you're working with real businesses, you're working on real projects, um, and I, I don't think that you could get that anywhere else, at least I, I, I feel that Cuesta delivered that for me for my business. It gave me confidence, uh, gave me a lot of research in which we use today at our business. Um, I don't think you get any more real in this in a controlled environment. People are living longer and it is affecting the EMS community. Uh, for As a paramedic educator, it's very challenging to try to uh, be able to keep up with all the advancements in medicines. The new medications patients are taking are now, we used to see sick patients when they were 60, now we're seeing sick patients when they're like 80 or 90. So um, always evolving, always getting more and more medications on our list and more and more things to do. So it becomes challenging as a paramedic educator to be able to keep up with this. We do keep up with some new advancements of the equipment, such as uh, uh, the laryngoscope, which is one of uh, the new things, being able to uh, actually digitally see into someone's throat to be able to put a tube down in. We also have a 12 lead testing allows us to see uh, patients who are having car cardiac complications um, at a higher level. We can actually, they, we're doing things that they're doing in the hospital now out in the field. And uh, it's pretty exciting, but again, it's really challenging too. 
Quest has prepared us by keeping us with national standards so we're able to get our licenses um, in a state and a national level. They do a really good job of promoting us into the local hospitals and local ambulance companies for us to be able to do our in-field um, education and that's a huge benefit to us and a stress off of our shoulders to be able to promote ourselves coming from this school to be able to get a job within months after we're done with this program. It's very important to have a, a skilled technician these days with the high-tech vehicles that we work on through electronics and hydraulics uh, and also the hybrid cars that are coming out. It takes a, a very intelligent, articulate person to do that and that's the training here helps them along. The need for skilled labor, especially in the automotive field, is huge because you know people say, oh, anybody can fix a car, but these days Vehicles are so complex, they're, they're practically rolling computers. I mean, everything on the car is computer controlled. You'll see anywhere on a state-of-the-art new car, you'll see anywhere from 20 to 30 to 40 onboard computers controlling all the different systems. So there's a lot of training and, and real skilled, direct uh, education that you need to have to be able to properly repair, diagnose and repair those vehicles. And that's something that having well-equipped and, and very successful training programs like the one here at Cuesta College are essential. Our typical welding program is a two-year degree, associate science degree, and in that program we basically have the basic welding classes. We teach you MIG and TIG, we teach you pipe welding, structural welding, along with metallurgy, weld power. So we have a fairly robust program we've put together so that our students come out industry, they're well-rounded, and they can actually take off and go from here. Even in these economic times, there's an extreme need for welders. You can come here, take a program, get out there and get a good paying job and have a good career. Cuesta College is uh, providing uh, the stepping stones for my future in becoming a welder. All the instructors here have industry experience and they put that right out on the table for you and uh, provides a great learning experience. Well, you know, we're such a great uh, local resource that anybody who has a specific idea about a job or a career, uh, this is a great starting point. Um, it's inexpensive, it's accessible, it's friendly environment, and we can match up their interests with uh, whatever skills they're looking for. One of the beauties of community college, and especially Quest, is uh, you don't have to have a definite idea in mind. You know, we match up what your interests are as a student with, uh, with our programs and services that we have available. In times of prolonged and unprecedented economic challenges, business leaders, economists, and lawmakers aren't the only sources of market stability. The academic sector also has its own innovators, educators, and future business leaders who are meeting the challenges of today's economy head on and creating new paths to economic recovery. For more information, Call 805-546-3100 or visit cuesta.edu.